Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Today, we are going to be talking about crew positions in the film industry. However, for the sake of time, we are only going to be covering two of them from my own choosing. My name is Matt Watson, and I will be your guide on this journey we're going to take today. So just sit back and enjoy the ride. Whether you're making featured films or documentaries, short films, or maybe even music videos, they all share the same fact that you will need a crew of many different departments. And each department is essential to the success of a project from its inception to its completion. However, for the purposes of this video, I will only be talking about two of these departments. So one of the crew positions I will be talking about today is the director. The director is one of the most important positions in all of filmmaking, in my opinion. They are typically involved from the pre-production phase all the way to the post-production phase. And their responsibilities are so vast that it would take too long to say them all today. But their main focus is making sure that the creative process is centered towards what their vision for the story is. The director deals directly with the actors as well, making sure they know what they're doing and when, as well as how they're supposed to do these things. After all, it is the director's vision that everyone is attempting to showcase. As well, they also have working relationships with the producer as well as the director of photography, which is also known as a DP, as well as the editors in post-production and many other departments as well. A key skill for directors is making and maintaining relationships. A director, for example, that I look up to is J.J. Abrams. I love J.J. Abrams' approach to directing and how he loves collaborating with people, and how he believes that nobody's idea is better than anyone else's. All in all, I think collaboration is very important in making a good film through all the stages. The second position that we will be talking about today is the production designer, known as the PD. This is as well as a very important part of the filmmaking process, not to say that it is any more important than any other department. However, the production designer is the person whose major responsibility is making sure that the overall visual look of her production matches the director's vision for this project. They also have to have a good communication and relationship with many departments, including the art department and the director of photography, just to name a few. So everyone is on the same page and can get the results that matches the theme of the project. An example of a good production designer is a man by the name of Adam Stockhausen. In Adam's short career, he's very accomplished, and he's very skilled at crafting sets that really tell a story. He also has great relationships with directors, such as his relationship with director Wes Anderson, who because of their relationship, he tends to use Adam as his production designer in his films. Like all departments in film, this is all team-based, so everyone really needs to get along in order to make the best possible project. There also needs to be complete and total cohesion, and this is going to lead to proper communication between all the departments, which then will result in good collaboration, and that's going to generate a great project outcome.